Okay guys, today is Thursday, July 25th, 2019, and we are in the Mandalay Bay at eBay Open 2019. And seated next to me is a man that needs no introduction, but I'm going to introduce him anyway, Steve Rakin from the Rakin Profit Channel. Steve, thanks for being on the show today. Yeah, appreciate you having me on the show. And, you know, we've been recording a bunch of videos on my channel and you've been dropping a ton of knowledge and just want to thank you because... You've, you've inspired me and hundreds and thousands of other people on YouTube and at the eBay Open, so it's great to be here on video sitting next to you. Cool. It's ironic. Both of us live on the East Coast, and we never see each other unless we're here in Vegas. <laughs> right? we got to change that, man. For sure. So what do you think about the eBay Open so far? So, oh, you just made a sale. Hey, Congratulations. Yeah. A live sale on the Crazy New York Driver Show. We got the good mics right now, so that's going to pick that up. It picks it up when I do them at home, too. So, there's been a lot of uh, kind of groundbreaking releases over at the uh, eBay Open. A couple things that I uh, am very intrigued by. Number one, thank you, eBay. Thank you for finally allowing me to add users onto my eBay account so I don't have to give somebody my login and password. We were just talking about Thank that earlier. You. <laughs> that is a monumental announcement. You guys can now have users on your account that are restricted to only certain functions. A lot of big sellers are gonna love that. Yeah, especially the sellers who um, hire virtual assistants. Yes. So I, I hire a lot of virtual assistants. I've used them in the past on eBay. Um, right now I use them in, in other businesses. But when you're hiring somebody on for example, I use upwork.com, upwork.com. Mm -hmm. You can hire people in the Philippines, other countries for as little as $4 an hour, which seems like a horrible wage. But in the Philippines, $4 an hour is an amazing wage. The average worker over there, I think, is making less than a dollar per hour, Yikes. or even a dollar a day That's some, ridiculous. at times. But it's different. You know, a dollar's worth, it's got a different value. Mm -hmm. over there. So $4 an hour is an amazing wage. You could really help support a family out there with that type of wage. Um, but it's always nerve wracking giving somebody your login and password who's from a different country. Sure. So that was big. Another uh, big update that I, I haven't seen it yet. I wasn't at the event. I just heard about it was the new um, picture editing software that they created. So for example, say you list an item maybe on a black background you can now like push a button, and I think it's rolling out in the next two weeks. Yes, Teresa I saw it. Cox was saying I it, saw turns the demo. It, it turns into a nice white background. What were your thoughts on that? They showed us a couple of examples with two different purses. In the first example, I think the purse was pink, and when they applied the change or the filter, as the case may be, it came out looking perfect. Mm. In the second example, the purse was longer, and it was green, and when they applied the filter there was a small black border still going around it. It wasn't 100% perfect, but it was still pretty darn good. Yeah. I think it's a very good tool, and this is another positive announcement from eBay. Yeah, those are the two big things that really stand out to me, but it seems like, do you remember last year, because Joe and I, we recorded a couple videos on my channel last year. Do you remember last year, the theme, the vibe, the energy that people were kind of giving off was, eBay's not siding with the sellers. eBay doesn't care about the sellers. And I think that they heard it loud and clear because it really does sound like they, um, they really listened to what we had to say. I agree. In fact, earlier this morning, I came from a workshop on seller protection. Okay. And the representatives were saying that they are looking out for bad buyers who are trying to game the system. For instance, a person who buys something, wants to return it and claims it's snad even though it's not SNAD, just to get the seller. What does SNAD actually mean? SNAD stands for significantly not as described. Oh, got it, got it. And as you probably know, anytime a buyer hits that SNAD button, you, the seller, automatically have to pay. Now, one big change eBay has implemented, if you remember, Steve, when you would go to return something, there was a list of reasons. Yeah, of course. And right near the top, was not as described, arrived broken, blah, blah, blah. And those are the reasons that we would have to pay the shipping back. Yeah. That's changed. All the reasons on top now 
are reasons that the seller is not responsible for, like change mind, found a better price, ordered wrong size, mm. doesn't fit. Because people are lazy. We were yeah. talking in our last video, people are lazy. Whatever's up the closest from the top to the bottom, people are just gonna choose it. They don't even hit the drop down menu sometimes. Yeah, they just choose it. Yeah. Then we get screwed. Exactly. So that's cool. That's definitely a positive change. That's awesome. In addition, they said they're also going to look out for buyers who do this repeatedly. And that if this happens to you, you should click the report a buyer link. Even though the prevailing theory is that it does nothing, they are saying now that they have bots that are picking up all these bad buyers. Mm. And that the first time they'll get a warning, the second time they'll be suspended, and the third time they'll be banned. Okay. Now they are aware that there are people out there that will once banned make another fake second account and mm. come back. They know about that. Yeah. All right. And they said that they're going to try and address that. Yeah. Is it an ironclad thing yet? No. But they're taking a step in the yeah. right. Yeah, they're taking a step. They know the problem exists and they're going to address it. Yeah. Well, that's really cool. Yeah, it really does seem like, like we said, again, the common theme is eBay's really trying to take care of the sellers. Whereas in the past, it always seemed like, oh, they were just out for the buyers. So it feels good. It feels good. Right, they were always pro buyer because they wanted to attract people to the site and let them know that the site is safe. Exactly. Another thing that they're pushing right now is the managed payments. Okay. I was invited to a special seminar early this morning, which I went to where they talked about managed payments and how it's been rolled out gradually and how they would still like all of us to join. But the only negative thing, I gotta be honest with you, is they still do not incorporate the global shipping program. Mm. And for me, that's important because I'm getting five sales a week. Wow. Global shipping, and you know why I'm getting so many? Because a lot of eBay Motors sellers already joined in to manage payments. Oh. So they're shut out and I'm still, I'm still wow. viable. Wow. So I'm getting the overflow. So hopefully they'll create a solution for that soon. They said eventually, they said maybe the end of the year or early next year. Okay. But that's to be seen. Cool, man, yeah, it's been fun. It's been a good time hanging out here with you, brother. It really has. For sure. Awesome. Let's cool. do this again. Yeah, let's definitely do it again. Thanks everybody for watching. It's, uh, it's awesome being on this channel, for sure. Thanks for being on the channel. And I'll drop a link to Steve's channel in the description box below but I'm sure all you guys know it because he's way more popular than I am. No, but you guys are in good hands with Joe because he is crushing it right now on eBay and your hubcap business and you're actually living the life and doing it big. So keep listening to Joe, he's the man. Thanks, Steve. Yeah, appreciate you, brother. See you once again. All right, see you guys. Bye.